new update for Adobe Presenter, exclusively available for our subscription and ASA customers, you can now seamlessly import and sync audio. Let's see how you can import and sync audio with ease with Presenter 8. Now here under the uh, presenter ribbon, you'll find the audio section, which allows you to record, import, sync and edit audio. If you want to see uh, the improvements we've made in the recording interface, please watch the video related to the audio recording workflow. But if you're looking at importing and syncing, now we have made it a one step procedure. Previously, you had to click import, import the files here and then go to the sync button and go and sync up the files. But not anymore. You can just go and click the sync button and that will bring up this sync dialog which allows you to see the screen in full screen mode and you have the way to move the control panel anywhere you want and here on the top right corner you see this small button which allows you to import audio so you don't have to do it um, from the import button you can do it directly here in case you forget to add audio it brings up the same dialog and here you can go and add the audio that you want to uh, import for this file once you're done click ok and that file is imported and now it allows you to sync the audio uh, based on the animations that you have so now on this uh, on this slide i have three animations and when i start clicking sync it starts playing the audio for me so that i can listen and then i can start syncing so i will click the sync button and then it will show me the next animation button in place of the play button and i will click it there so i'm uh, clicking the sync animation so you're a manager in a government organization responsible for a sustainable energy strategy. You're launching an exciting new initiative that aims to increase students' awareness of renewable energy in key colleges through roadshow exhibitions. As always, you're very busy and have enlisted the help of Nicola, a bright and enthusiastic junior colleague, to write the proposal for the roadshow approach and then make it all happen. Most of Nicola's proposal is very good. So you saw that uh, as soon as my animation was over, it, it showed me the next slide button. I didn't click it. And as soon as the, the audio was over, it play, started playing the next slide audio. And it started showing the animations for that. So you can easily uh, go and sync up the audio for the entire project in one go. Isn't it very simple to work with? Go ahead and give it a try. And I'm sure you'll love this workflow. Thanks for watching this video.